Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's my hope and my prayer that everyone is well, that everyone is blessed and feeling good today. I wanted to come on here so that I could pray for people. I felt this morning in my own private time with God that there are a lot of people that are in need of prayer and I just want to facilitate that and to just assist you guys in that process so I'm here now the reason I want to pray with you guys is because my family as well as other families that I'm connected to as well as my clients and people I've been talking to lately have been getting blessed God has been answering so many prayers. He's just been beyond faithful to a lot of people. I've been hearing stories of physical healing and financial blessings and uh, people just coming out of just laziness and poverty mindset and just so much. People who have lost people are actually experience extreme peace and they're no longer mourning very quickly and it's just a lot of things are happening for people but at the same time a lot of things are not happening for people so i just want to pray for the people who are just asking and believing god to do something and maybe you haven't seen the fruit of your prayers i just want to connect with y'all and i'm just asking god to bless you guys abundantly so god i just thank you so very much for this day god i thank you for this morning father i thank you for just giving us this opportunity god to just connect to um be kind and submit all of our prayers all of our worries all of our anxieties unto you lord god you are a good god and i believe father that you just have the power and ability to to do so many great and amazing things in your children's lives Lord God right now father God I like to thank you in advance for your forgiveness for your un unconditional love Lord God for your provision father God for your healing Lord God with all of your children Lord God all around the world father God but more specifically Lord God for those who are in need right now I want to submit this time Lord God and just pray to you so I got a red light yay um God, I just thank you, Lord God, for every single woman right now, Lord God, that is in need of a breakthrough, Father God, that is believing you, Lord God, uh, to be her healer, to be her provider, Lord God, to grant her peace, Lord God, and grace and mercy in this time. Father God, I am asking, Lord God, that you would just heal her right now, heal her mind, Lord God, of any worries, Lord God, any stress, Lord God, any anxiety, Father God, anything that is just keeping her in a negative space, Lord God, any bit of depression, Father God. I'm asking, Father God, that you would just heal her completely, Lord God. Allow her to feel joy, Lord God. Allow her to dream beautiful dreams, Father God. Allow her to have help for the future, Lord God, because her future is so great and is so bright, Lord God. As she submits things to you, Lord God, I am just praying, Lord God. Lord God, I'm praying right now for the woman, Lord God, that might be having difficulty, Lord God, with homeschooling, Lord God, or just the transitions of 2020, Lord God, and her family environment is a little bit off, Father God. I'm just asking, Lord God, that you would just be there for her heart, Lord God, that you will strengthen her mind, Lord God, that you will give her peace, Lord God, that you will give her uh, a specific strategy, Lord God, for each and every one of her child, Lord God, that will lead to a success, Lord God, that she desires, Lord God, but ultimately a success that will give you glory, Lord God. I thank you, Lord God, for extending your peace to every single household right now, Lord God. Any household, Lord God, that is, that is just in any bit of anguish, Lord, Lord God, any frustration, Lord God, any bit of... um. Just any lack of peace, Lord God, any disturbance, Father God, I ask, Lord God, that you will sing your peace, Lord God, and you will give them a peace that surpasses all understanding, Father God, that you will just be God in their lives, Lord God, that you will reign supreme, Lord God, that when they wake up in the morning, Lord God, they will just be filled with so much joy and have so much hope, Lord God, of your ability to provide, Lord God, of your ability to heal, Father God, I thank you, Lord God, for bringing, breathing hope into the hopeless right now, Lord God, those of uh, your children, Lord God, who are just asking for a healing, Lord God, who are asking for another day, Lord God, who are asking for peace of mind Lord God just allow them to see it and allow them to believe that you are the person that can do it all for them Lord God because that's what you do Father God you show up for your children and you show up well Lord God I thank you Lord God for every single one of your daughters Father God that is believing you Father God for healing right now Lord God that is believing you for a breakthrough Lord that is believing you for, for, um, for, for provision God I thank you God, I thank you for allowing me to articulate this prayer so that the people can hear it and understand it, God. You're a good God. I praise you, Father God, for the time, Lord God, that women are spending, Lord God, talking to you, praying, Lord God, towards you, Lord God, praying for their family and their friends and their own lives, Lord God. I thank you, Father God, for those intimate moments, Lord God, where you're allowing your children to hear your voice, Lord God, and you're giving them clear direction, Lord God, and strategy for their success, Lord God. I thank you, Father God, for releasing the shackles, Lord God, off of your daughter's minds, Lord God, and helping them to be 
be completely free in you, Lord God. I thank you, Father God, that you are doing it and you are doing it right now and you are doing it well, Lord God. I thank you, Lord God, for opening up the windows of heaven, Lord God, and showering down, showering down many blessings in your daughter's lives, Lord God. You know the things that they are desiring, Lord God. You know the things that they need, Lord God. I thank you that all of their needs are met, Lord God, that all of their bills are paid, Lord God, that they are experiencing physical healing in their bodies, Lord God, that you are healing, Lord God. Um, women's bodies, Lord God, of any type of sickness or disease, Lord God, that is keeping them from having children, Lord God. I thank you, Lord God, for covering wombs, Lord God, and uteruses, Lord God, with your blood, Lord God. I thank you, Lord God, for the women, Lord God, that received an answer no from a doctor, Lord God, will receive an answer yes from you, Lord God, in 2020, no later than 2021, Lord God. You are breathing life into these bodies, Lord God. You are allowing us to give birth to the next generation, Lord God, that is going to lead people, Lord God, to you, Lord God, that is going to act accordingly to your word, Lord God, that we're not going to wait into our 20s and our 30s and our 40s and our 50s and our 60s to get it together, Lord God. But our children will do better than us, Lord God. Our children, Lord God, are going to be the sons and daughters of the Most High God, Lord God. They're going to walk in power and authority, Lord God. They're going to walk in your truth and your victory, Lord God. I thank you, Lord God, for healing this land and healing this nation, Lord God, and just having your will and your way be done, Lord God. You are doing it and you are doing it well, and I just praise you, God. I thank you, Father God, for every single daughter of yours who does not know you, Lord God, that you've been desiring to have a relationship with Lord God I thank you for breaking down the barriers right now Lord God and allowing her Lord God to connect with you like never before Lord God heal her broken heart Lord God heal her mind Lord God help her to forgive herself and to forgive others that have hurt her Lord God allow her to experience a new life and be a new creature in you Lord God I thank you Lord God for the peace Lord God I thank you for the purpose Lord God that is coming upon your daughter's lives, Lord God. I thank you, Father God, that you have given all of your daughter's dreams, Father God, and they will see those dreams fulfilled, Lord God, in the form of marriages, Lord God, in the form of businesses, Lord God, in the form of prosperity, Father God. I thank you, Lord God, that you are blessing their children, you're blessing their homes, Lord God, you're blessing their bank accounts, you're blessing their bodies, Lord God. You are allowing them, Father God, to just see things about their future that they've never even seen, Lord God. Give her a vision of her being on stage, speaking to the masses, empowering the masses. Give her a vision, Father God, of seeing all of her children debt-free with multiple properties all around the world, Lord God. Give her a vision, Father God, of her being loved by a good man that won't cheat on her, that won't hit her, that won't abuse her, Lord God, that will speak life into her and support her purpose, Lord God. Give her a vision, Lord God, of her family coming together and her being healed in her body, Lord God, and her being healed in her mind, Lord God. Give her a vision, Father God, of the future, something that she can hold on to, Lord God, something that she can go after, Lord God, in the morning and in the night saying, God, I believe you for this. I believe you that my grandfather's coming out of this. I believe you that my brother's gonna have peace. I believe you that you're doing this for my sister and my my friends and my kids and you're doing it for me right now lord god give her a vision god i thank you lord god i thank you for the vision lord god i thank you lord god that that the women will see god that the women will hear god that the women will just be so comforted by who you are and what you're able to do for them god you're a good god you're answering prayers right now in 2020 god i've seen you do just whew, God, you have blessed me beyond measure. And I just ask, Father God, that you would just continue to bless all those who um, just come to you, God, who believe in you, Lord God, who submit their cares and concerns to you, God. You're so good. You're so good, God. So we ask this all in Jesus' name. We praise you. God, we thank you. We seal this prayer in Jesus' name. May your will be done and nothing less. Amen and amen. Amen, guys. Good morning. Peace and blessings. I hope that you guys are well. I hope that you guys are just trusting God with it all because he is doing it all. He's doing it all for you. He's doing it all for your family. He's doing it all for your children. He's doing it all for your friends. He is setting things up and having his way in amazing ways. And he just needs you to believe. He needs you to submit that thing to him. He needs you to put that baby's name on the altar, that situation on the altar and say, God, I'm done with it. I'm not worrying about it anymore. I'm not being anxious about it anymore. I'm believing that you are going to be God and you're going to provide a way out of no way. And you're going to lead us to healing. You're going to lead us pro to prosperity. You're going to bring our family together God whatever it is you are believing keep on telling him day in and day out and outside of telling God what you're believing him for y'all I need you guys to really affirm yourselves in that thing okay before I got the house before I got the marriage before I got the opportunities I was already speaking those things that aren't as though they were I am a good wife my children have an amazing father I am healed in my mind my body and my spirit
I am prospering in all ways. I am a multimillionaire. I am debt free. I am the whatever, whatever it is you want to be. All right. I got to go get some paper towel. <laughs> I got to go in the store. I got to go in the store and I need to go pick up my kids from their dad. For women and families who are in co-parenting situations, do everything that you can to make it work. And even if the person is acting crazy, just submit that to God and ask that God will just bless them abundantly and that they will go do their greatest good. All right. So we're just spreading peace, love, and blessings. I'm kind of out of breath. Whew. Obviously, I ain't been on my cardio. Okay. I'll talk to you guys soon. Peace and blessings to you all. Stay encouraged. God is doing everything right now. All right. Peace.